Hi everybody. Okay, so here we are, August 26th. So I wanted to just give you a little rundown of the day. I'm trying to do these in the morning, but um, I had a busy morning this morning. I had to get my dogs to get their teeth cleaned. And anyway, so here we are. So 26th of August, um, we're in Virgo season. And, you know, I just wanted to share about two um, two Virgos that have been so influential on the world, both so service driven, um, who had birthdays today. One was Mother Teresa and one is Yogi Bhajan. So they were both born on August uh, 26th. Let's see if I've got the dates written down here. Yeah, Yogi Bhajan, August 26, 1929 and Mother Teresa, St. Teresa of Calcutta, August 26, 1910. Okay, so what do they have in common? As I just said, they, are, they were so service-oriented. They brought the message of love, um, and that's how they lived their life. Obviously, Yogi Bhajan uh, brought Kundalini Yoga, and he was a yoga teacher. And Mother Teresa was really influential and uh, for helping the poor, but they both gave this message of love. So I have some of their quotes here. I thought I might share them with you today. So some of the things that Yogi Bhajan is famous for saying. An attitude of gratitude brings great things. Travel light, live light, spread the light, be the light. If you can't see God in all, you can't see God at all. If you're willing to look at another person's behavior towards you as a reflection of the state of their relationship with themselves, rather than a statement about your value as a person, then you will cease to have crazy reactions. <laughs> um, okay, so many words of wisdom from Yogi Bhajan and Equally from uh, Mother Teresa, she is famous for saying, let us always meet each other with a smile, for the smile is the beginning of love. If you are humble, nothing will touch you, neither praise nor disgrace, because you know who you are. This one, do not wait for leaders, do it alone, person to person. Spread love wherever you go. Let no one ever come to you without leaving happier. And Yogi Bhajan says something similar. I want to be so happy that everybody that sees me wants to be so happy. Yeah, it's contagious. Okay, so, so there are two focused Virgos born on August 26th. So today we've got the moon in Virgo. As I said, it's Virgo season. We've got the sun in Virgo. Uh, went into Virgo August 22nd. We'll be there uh, for a month, actually a month, yeah. And then Mercury right now is also in Virgo from last week through to the beginning of September. So Virgo, service oriented. Ask the questions, what can I do to be of service? What can I do to be helpful? in the way that it's like oh not if i do this for you will you do something for me or will i get something in return it's that kind of service oriented that you're doing it um you're you're being of service for the that's it the good enough reason of being of service to be kind to be uplifting to help so you know these days many um situations that we can be helpful and it is often the small things as you know mother Teresa says you know it's like one thing help one person she's famous for saying if you want to change the world go home and love your family you know it's like these small things we don't have to do like huge amazing things so I'm hoping that my videos are of service to you that in some way they um, inspire you or give you a little message um, keep you on track that is my mission um, they're all free. I'm here. Okay, so um, so yes, Lisa, you are also one of my favorite Virgos. You've been on my mind. Uh, so Virgos, what do they like to do? They like to yeah, um, be de they're detail oriented, focused. Yeah, so it's not about big picture. It's about 
get in the details together. So, um, you know, real great, Vir Virgos love a list <laughs> and they love a tidy kitchen drawer. You know that drawer where you put everything in it and it just gets crowded. Today would be a good day to um, empty that drawer and sort it out and put back what you need. Maybe organize your bookshelf. Definitely clean your house. Um, go through your spice cupboard. Um, you know, organize your wardrobe. Uh, you know, go through, um, go through your resume, update your resume. Um, read the details of a contract. Yeah, these are all uh, things that Virgo is really good at. And so if you do those things today, you'll be really good at them too. Uh, Virgo rules digestion, the intestines actually. So, um, you know, I was thinking, oh, that's interesting because, you know, if, if things don't feel like they're organized, you know, or, or getting out of hand, it can, it can make you anxious, yeah? It can kind of give you a stomach ache, it can kind of cause that inflammation. So um, getting yourself organized, getting yourself sorted out, clear out the clutter, and you will calm your intestines down. Obviously, you can drink some nice herbal teas, fennel, ginger, um, turmeric, uh, what else? Cardamom, um, calendula, all these things help to calm the intestines, maybe reduce the inflammation. Alrighty, anything else I want to say? Yeah, I think that's it. So have a wonderful Virgo season, but in particular, where the moon is there today, um, do some of those things and see how you feel and ask yourself, continually be asking yourself, how can I right now be of service all right my lovelies have a wonderful day love you